Hey everybody, welcome to a new series on my channel, one I hope to make regular. Uh, I am going to be playtesting games that are in development and giving my first impressions on them. I'll generally be doing one video per game and keeping it relatively short if I can, uh, barring major updates that are worth covering. Maybe I'll do multiple videos if, if a game I've covered before has gotten an update. Uh, the idea here is to spotlight lesser known games that are in development to help you viewers uh, pick and choose what's worth following. So uh, any footage that's shown here obviously does not reflect the final game quality. Things may change because these are games that are in development currently. Uh, the first batch that I'm doing here is handpicked from the TIGSource playtesting forum. Uh, I'd like to also open this up for submissions, so if anyone who's watching this is working on a game and would like it covered, uh, get in touch with me and uh, we can talk about doing that possibly, or you know, just send me a link in a YouTube message or something and I will take a look at it. So the first game that we will be doing here is called Bonds. Uh, and I'm just going to play and see what happens. Okay, this looks like some sort of level select hub. So level one is unlocked. I assume this is yeah, this 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 is a demo with six levels in it, I know. And here they all are. Alright, let's go into level one. Down to enter. That's a good question. Does this world loop or Okay. Could I have gone right instead of going left? Uh, let's pick up the key. And also check to the right, because I'm curious. It feels really good. I like the movement. Audio seems good. It's playing in a relatively small window right now. I don't want to attempt to resize it, because um, it'd mess up my recording most likely. Uh, if I... Okay, there's no pause screen apparently. Let's see. I got to one somehow. How did I do that? Alright, so Alt Enter, which I would normally expect to toggle full screen. Uh, I went to the pause screen. Maybe it's just... Okay, it's just Enter. Um, Alright, so those are our options apparently. Okay, let's go into this door. Okay, I didn't have to press down or anything. Just as soon as I touched it, it took me there. How did I end up in a place like this to begin with? Screen's a lot smaller now. Can't go left. Whoa, I'm moving fast. Alright, so it looks like a big jump to get the key. Whee! Mm hmm. Yeah, so as I understand it, this is the core mechanic here. You have you're controlling two uh two characters at once, and it seems like basically collisions are shared between them, so what collides with one collides with the other. So that explains the uh, mysteriously not empty pit here. So everything else appears to be the same for these two. Can I get past this door? No. Just have to go in. I wanted to see what was left for the, the bottom character. Enter to open the pause menu, make a mistake, and restart the level there. Okay, cool. Let's try searching to the arrow keys. WASD was a little bit awkward. I cannot get up there, but uh, I believe this thing is pushable. Yep. Oh, interesting. So is this, this pushes by one tile at a time, it looks like? Okay. So I can't just push it pixels at a time. Well, maybe. No? No, just gives it a big push as soon as I touch it. So pretty much I don't need to pay attention to the bottom screen right here. Or, well, now I do. Ah, a little bit of weirdness there. Ah, I can sneakily get on... Oh, I... Oh! 
interesting. Okay. I'm curious about something. Oh, okay, it just takes me back down here. Right, because the bottom of the level's not, not open. So my jump is a little bit less than two tiles high. Wait a second, this is confusing. Why is... Okay, well, anyway. Uh, hmm. I can't get up the... Oh, right, right, right. I can give the uh, box to, to this one. And jump. Key one. What happens if I go with only one key? Do they both have to have it to get out? It's not open. Okay, so they both have to have it. Acceleration's a little wonky. Like, it, it starts out really slow and then suddenly moves really fast. Well, no, I guess it's not that sudden. It just takes a little bit to get going. Okay. For jumps like these, that's... Oops. A little bit annoying. There we go. Okay, both keys. Out we go. See. Oh, hey, I can see the other one on the on the uh, on the top there. Interesting. Okay, so space uh, toggles between top, bottom, and both. Oh, I did it wrong. Uh, yeah, I, I see what I've done wrong. I need to um, I need to reset. So space, jump, jump, jump. What if I rebond right here? Interesting, interesting. Okay. Yeah. At first I was thinking the mechanic was a little bit weak, but this is making it very interesting. I go to the other world? Nope, that's just death. Gotta try. Oh, interesting. So if I if I press jump and uh, sideways at the same time, it's hmm. So if I jump first and then move, I move slowly. But if I yeah, if I do both at the same time, it's much easier to control. Okay. What does that say? Memorize the other world, reconnect your partner. Sure, that's one thing I can do. What else can I do? Can't go there. I could put a box under her feet. Which doesn't really help me with anything. Uh, okay. Pretty hard to see what's down. That's just a... <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do that. There we go. Okay, so one is at her door. We need the other one, too. Okay, here we go. Kind of parallel world stuff going on here. Hmm. I don't think I can make that jump. Oh, I can. Okay, I'm wrong. All 
Alright, so I'm gonna stay bonded as much as I can. Oh man, seems like a lot of potential for things to get out of sync here. Like right now, we're not quite the same. But that's okay. So if I push this here... Hmm. So it broke on the top screen, it looks like? Yeah, that figures. Alright, so we know how to get one key. Whoops! Oh! Uh, ooh, right, because I disconnected over the... I see. I have to leave you there. And then do this. Get them a little better in sync this time, just in case it makes a difference. This is a different way than I went before. Okay, whoa! Oh, okay, we're good. Okay, that's what I found right. I just kept going this way. Alright, so push that, push that, push that. And I don't really... I know there's a pit down there somewhere. I want to descend safely if I can. Hmm. Nope. Alright, I'm just going to have to jump from up there, it looks like. Oh, I can stand on the rock. Didn't notice that before. Oh wait, no, 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 I can't. It's because there's a platform here. Never mind. Yeah. I think I only managed to fall down that pit because the two were kind of out of sync before. So if I keep them more closely synchronized, this is made easier. Alright, both have keys. Now I just need to get both to their doors. Hmm. Hmm. That seems like a problem, though. So let's see. What if I were to edge you over there? And then... Hang on. Actually, if I just leave you here, then we're fine. Okay. I have to mess with them a little bit to get up here. Oh, I can't make... Um. Alright, so I need to do something with this box. Does that let me do what I want? No, not really. Okay, I don't need to mess with that box. She's right. But I can't make that jump. How do I... What do I need to do to make that possible? Not that. I... Mm, this feels simple, but for some reason I'm not quite seeing what I need to do. Like, I need one to stand on a box, so the other one can... Alright, if I break it here, I always end up falling down that pit. I need to find the right spot. If this is even the right solution. So leave you here. Move you there. Then if I... Okay. 
That lets me do that, but that doesn't actually help. It's the other one I need on the box, isn't it? Except I can't make that jump. Okay. Ah. Um. Both of you up here. I need I need the blue one on a safe platform. She needs to be up one. How do I even do that? Like this? That doesn't help. Just made it worse. Hmm. All right. Well, let me um. Let me noodle on this a little bit. I don't know why I'm not seeing the solution. I feel like it's simple, but I'm just not seeing it. So give me a moment and I'll see if I can figure it out. All right. <laughs> I don't know why I keep forgetting this mechanic. That's actually a pretty important one. We can do that. Don't need that box to get up, but that gives it to the other one. So now we can get where we want to be. Yeah, this is this is a leap of faith right here. This shouldn't happen. Okay, well at least there was no pit down there. Got your key? Uh hmm. Hmm. What's the thing to do here? Think of a few possibilities, but none of them seem particularly good. Okay, so I can't disconnect while I'm jumping. What if I just move you back one? Oops. Does that help? That does help. Okay. Alright. That's you. Now you can get back to where you need to be, and it's solved. Which level am I on? There are six in the demo. I guess that was number six. Okay. Cool. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I like that game a lot. Um, I can see the potential for puzzles to get pretty hard. Um, but, yeah, that, that showcases them pretty well. So, anyway, uh, if you like this game, uh, I will put a link to the forum thread where I found it. Uh, and also the developer's website. Um, yeah, that's the first of my playtesting and first impressions videos. Pretty solid game. I liked it a lot. Anyway, see you guys. Ah, oh, we missed a credit sequence. Okay, let's come back for this. That's weird part of the text from the previous thing is still on screen just a little bit. Right up here. Alright, now it's over. See ya.